What's up guys, welcome to Rafa's Garage. Today, we're installing the stereo for my girl. I bought it for her birthday. She didn't like the old one because it had buttons. So we got one with the push knob. This one doesn't have um, CD player or DVD player. We don't use that anyways. Um, we didn't know it change on that one right now. And we also swapped the O2 sensor on that one because it was giving her a code for the first one. Um, and then right now she's replacing the airbag because her airbag is actually lifted. It's like lifting like this much off the um, dash. And then we're hearing some weird noises in the back. So she's going to take off the dash right now. So it gives me an opportunity to install this right now. So yeah, let's get to it. Sorry, I took off the stereo. Um, basically, all you have is this pops out. Um, you do have to unscrew this one because the boot um, is there. Um, then you got a screw right here, a screw right here, a Phillips. Then you also have, if you have the analog ones, which I don't, I have the HVAC, you got some inside the knob. So you just got to pull the knobs out and then. Um, this one should be able to pop out the top piece all together and then unplug your clock and for me i had to unplug the hvac um and i'm seeing right now uh this is a different stereo pioneer to sony i can use the same harness so i gotta use the harness and i don't have the the connections to do it and i don't want to use twist and, and electrical tape i don't want to use that so i gotta go to autozone buy that real quick um these are the brackets for the stereo hopefully i can use these for this one i'm gonna try it out i'm gonna test fit it i also had these little things which go on the side so i could feel the gap uh, i'm not sure if these will work for the other one i gotta test fit it on the on the face and see if it works that's what i'm gonna do right now so it does fit and that's what the little plastics for so you could fill in that gap right there i'm gonna see if they work um see if i could use these and try it right now it's kind of hard to hold the camera and test fit it and show you guys but i'll see right now put everything together working just uh the antenna is not the same so i gotta use their or their microphone which is this one so i have to rewire but everything's working So it's all done put it on everything is working we had to take it off again because um bad connection on one wire but that's how it looks off and it's starting up so let's try and connect to the bluetooth that's how it looks when it's in the home button tell you how it looks or how it feels Later. So overall, my girl likes it. Um, it does have um, car. I think it's called CarPlay, which allows you to put your maps on there. But the only downside, it has to be connected. So it's called CarPlay. messages here 
she likes it and that's good thanks for watching please like i'm out